YG recently released a brand new 3x3 called the MGC EVO. I've not seen many reviews and unboxings on YouTube, so I'll be showing you my first impressions of the cube. I actually got it with limited edition black internals and not the primary internals, so let's get into it. Okay, well, first off, the new logo is just- Why is the C so far away from the G? I guess it's easier for me to open this. Okay, well, the box- I mean, the colors are nice. Oh my god. Oh, okay. MGC Evo card. So I went for black internals because I'm pretty sure they're limited time only. Before we get into that, let's get into the accessories here. Killing the turtles. What's in here? Is this a bag? Oh, they do bags now. It's a nice bag. Good quality. It's great. Got the mini screwdrivers. They joined Gan on the mini screwdriver gang. I don't even know what I'm saying. Pamphlets that I'm going to never use and they're gonna be thrown into the bin. Main thing here is the cube. It feels very, very weird. I've not felt a cube frosted for a very long time. Yeah, it looks kind of strange, the MGC logo. I do think it looks prettier with primary internals, but I wanted it to be different because I always have primary internal cubes. This is my first ever MGC 2x3. Oh, oh geez. Tensioning system? That's kind of strange. Okay, I'm not gonna comment. Well, let's get into first turns. Please be good. Oh, it's very, very sandy. I'm kind of uncontrollable as well, but it feels sort of nice. Core cutting isn't the greatest. Definitely is in need of setup, but I think it has lots of potential. It sounds quite nice as well, but that's probably because it's really sandy, completely dry. It's like Gan, but it's not even honeycomb. Was taking out a piece of mistake? Oh sh! Their edges don't want to go in, and I think it's gonna be the same here. And I'm kind of. Did it just break? Oh, it's in here. What the hell? Well, that's unfortunate. I'm so confused. Oh, good. Oh, we're gonna forget about the emotional crisis I had there. That. How does this? Okay, I'm gonna use a baby screwdriver again. I don't think it works like that. I don't know what to do. I'm taking the piece out in first. Okay, well, never mind then. So far, this cube is kind of strange. Confuses me. Let's do a solve. Yeah, it's quite uncontrollable. I do think it will be good after some setup luck. So silly me decided to not do an outro, but I still haven't set it up and done a lot of solves on it. These are my final first impressions. Yes, as I said like a hundred times, it is incredibly sandy. When the piece popped out, I kind of got scared. I thought it broke, but it didn't. Thank you for scaring me, YJ. I'm pretty sure the number on the card means I'm like the 161st person to buy the cube with black internals. I'm not actually sure. But I do look forward to using this cube more and maybe I'll main it. I have no idea. If you're interested in buying this cube, make sure to buy it off the cubicle using code NDS. You help me out a lot and you get a discount. Make sure you have notifications on so you'll know when I make the more in-depth video of the MGC EVO. But for now, see you next time. Bye.